All right, first clip. And the title says Ancient Ghosts. So let's let's see what I think about this. Real realghostvideos.net. We'll we'll see about that. I'm going to turn the sound off. Actually, no, because there might be an EVP. I didn't consider that for a second. Might not just be audio. Or, not, <laughs> might not just be visual. It might be audio as well. Okay, number one, very blurry, very pixelated. So... It looks... Okay. Here's, here's what I'll say. The guy did sound pretty startled, so, like, I believe that he was, like, scared, but I don't think it's a spirit that startled him. Because look at how the light is shining through, and there's some light and a shadow behind whatever this is being casted, which makes me think this is something that is physically there. Um, it seems like it's just someone crouched down who's slowly getting up and they just accidentally spooked the guy. Realghostvideos.net again. Um, I hope that not all of these are from <laughs> realghostvideos.net. I, like, went through, uh, compilation as well as some individual search results to compile these. I have about eight here. Um, the title of this one is Kids Encounter Funeral Home Ghost, so possibly a very recently deceased person, if it is indeed a deceased person. Let's see. Okay, kids encounter funeral home ghost is what the title says, so I wonder if they mean kids as in teenagers. Also, it's very blurry, and just because it's cold, that in and of itself can't be enough of an indicator uh, that there is paranormal activity going on. It can be part of it, but just a temperature change would not be enough. Wait, hold on. Dude, you see it? I saw that. I saw that. Oh, yeah, I saw something. It looked like one of the tissues being like lifted up from the box. I don't know. I'm on the fence. I'm on the fence about this one, but I'm not gonna say that this one's not real because I don't know. I can't really tell. All right, third video, here we go. Ghost Highway question mark is the title. Oh no, not again, realghostvideos.net. A television journalist reports from the scene of a car accident on the M11 just outside London. But wait, what is this mysterious blob moving across the screen? The unusual image has been stirring debate among viewers of the ITV show London Tonight. 
It's being speculated that this could be some ghostly goings-on, something supernatural, spiritual energy or ectoplasm trying to cross the road. Producers of the show were forced to investigate. Their conclusion, after a detailed examination of the known facts, the form of anthropod. That's an insect to you and me that's crawling across the lens of the television camera. It could be. It could be an insect crawling across the camera. I'm not sure. I also don't know enough about cameras to say whether or not this, that it's possibly double exposure. Um, it is weird how it like comes down to ground level on the road and then starts moving across. But I'm not going to say that's paranormal because there's just not enough there. Alright, so the title of this one is Orbs Footage from the Early 90s. So the problem is that it's going to be a much older camera. And when it's an older camera, everything is more blurry. You don't have as much definition, so you don't know what you're looking at. So I don't think that I'm going to be able to have a definitive answer on this one, but I think it will still be interesting to look at. It's a very interesting close-up. The way it like moves like that, like almost in a quick figure eight, um, that makes me think insect. And it's from the early 90s, so again, you got not the best video quality. Could it be like a firefly or something? Maybe. Perchance. I don't know. Alright, here we go. Shadow ghost caught on tape. I know shadow people are a thing that a lot of uh, paranormal enthusiasts believe in. As a person who does buy into ghosts and stuff, shadow people, I'm like, I don't know. Perhaps, but I've never seen one. <laughs> oh no, realghostvideos.net strikes again. Okay, so we're looking for a shadow here. I've also watched lots of, like, top 10 paranormal videos, so I might have seen this before. It looks a tiny bit familiar. So it's someone clearly filming security footage. Oh, hi. Uh-huh. And it just rises up like that and then leaves and the people around it are none the wiser. That's really interesting because it literally just appeared Yeah, it appears and then it rises. Like, I know heat rises, so if this is some kind of dark, like, gas floating up. But this is a hard floor, so that's also not... That's not really a viable explanation here. I don't know, I'm not sure. This, I feel like I buy this more than any of the other clips I've seen so far. Um, out of the ones I'm reviewing in this video anyway, but... I don't know, that one I'll give it a more likely. But I still wouldn't say it's absolutely a ghost. 
Okay, creepy ghost sighting at window evidence caught on tape is what the title says. Let's see. This one is a little bit longer than some of the other clips. A minute and 31 seconds. Very nice old building. Perfect breeding ground for paranormal activity. What kind of accent do they have? Like, where is this? They seem to be genuinely creeped out, um, but they could just be good actors. Yeah, but they could have exited the building um, in time before they walked up there. I mean, that is very creepy. Especially because the face is, like, so pale. And the way it just sort of... He goes out of frame like that. But spirits usually don't appear with features that are that defined. So I would say this is a very elaborate and well done prank. Um, and that guy is a great actor. He, he did the creepy stare perfectly. Good for him, and he probably had some pale, very pale foundation on to really sell the look, but I'm not, I'm not really buying it, to be honest. Um, like, again, I'm a believer, but I also know that there are lots of people out there that will fake things, and I think most of the footage out there and photographs out there that people say are ghost-related actually aren't. Um, very few of it is actually authentic from what I um, de can determine, you know, not that, not that I'm an expert, but um, I have, I have had spiritual experiences, so. So this one is posted by the Daily Mail. Spooky moment ghosts appear to run across Gettysburg Field. So I have seen this one before, and um, it's really cool. Let's just get into it. At least, at least it's not that other website that keeps popping up in these. <laughs> Hilarious that I already forgot the name. Yeah, you can tell that person saw it. They started looking around, very confused. Let's look at that again. This looks like it's not an intelligent haunting, but rather residual. It's like they're loading up the cannons the way that they would have when they were alive. And then when the, that this person gets too close... The energy stops. This, I would say, is authentic. I, it, genuinely. 
this to me does seem authentic. Speaking of authentic, the title of this last one is most authentic ghost footage of all time, question mark, question mark, question mark. Uh, so let's see for ourselves. Also, it's very grainy, so I don't have super high hopes, but... So they're seeing lights. That's very interesting. It's like something... Something illuminating the trees. Um, I'm not going to say that it's ghosts, but I will say I don't personally have any idea of what that could be. I genuinely don't know. Um, it's very pretty to look at, <laughs> if anything. <laughs> Um, I, I really couldn't say. It's quite interesting, though. I think I might have seen this clip a long time ago. I can't remember, but that is the last clip that I'm taking a look at for this video. Thank you for watching all the way till the end. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you thought any of those were authentic. Um, I'm thinking about maybe doing a video taking a look at some famous EVPs. Um, I don't know if I will, so if you would like me to, then just tell me. Tell me that you would like that, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys!